Hey everyone, I'm coming here to do like a a um, craft haul. I haven't done one of these in so long. Y'all know it's been a hot minute since I have crafted as far as paper crafting, but I fell in love uh, with these Halloween collections from these two companies. <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> and I, well, excuse me, damn. I wanted to share with you... Um, what uh which ones I got and also a lot of y'all have been seeing some sneak peeks on my Facebook about what's happening in September with me. Um I fly out to Arizona um to, for a week to uh work on something crafty business and um I'm super excited about this. Um it's been uh in the works for several months. And, um, trust me, it is nothing, it's not going to be anything like whatever happened in my past or anything of that nature. So please, um, don't think that at all, um, you know, uh, Contracts have been signed and meetings have been made. Um, this is real and legit. So, um, I'm super excited about it. And all of you, of course, will benefit from this. Um, it is very, very uh, awesome. Extremely awesome. And um, I'm excited. And I'll be doing sneak peeks and everything, but... The uh, grand announcement will be in September. So, um, this is uh, the Echo Park uh, Trick or Treat collection this year. I'm, I'm a stinker for Halloween and fall. That is my most favorite time of the year. I got married in fall. Um, I love fall. Um... I just, it's my most favorite time of the year. And, um, so this kit contains 12, 12, 12 double-sided papers and an element sticker sheet. So, we're going to look at the uh, papers. And it looks like we get two of each of these. So, here's the dancing skeletons with some cute ephemera that you can cut out. I love the cats. I love the play on this collection where you have kind of like the old Halloween mixed in with the new Halloween. You know, kind of a new theme to it. So, I really like that. And I love this. This looks like painted ghosts and pumpkins. It's really, really pretty. I like this one. Um, the next one is the witch's hats. On some more ephemera, as you can see here, like you got the old looking uh, Halloween mixed with the new. And what I like about this collection, it looks hand painted. I love that look. I love the hand painted look. Reminds me of somebody painting on gourds or something. Um, here's the candy with again some more pumpkins, spider webs with. More ephemera, bobbin for apples, oh, trick or treating, I love it, trick or treat, smell my feet, give me soft sign, go don't eat, I used to say that when I was a kid, here is some banner like thing, and I love the plaid, so, and then last but not least, we have the sticker sheet again. Love, love, love. I love the play on the new with the old. Super cute. I'm going to be making some Halloween cards out of this. And also, I picked up the two, a two um, Echo Park designer um, stencils, six by six. This is the fall collection. And um, my favorite fall, which is the collection, that's what it's called. This one is called uh, Tossed Pumpkins, as you can tell. And then this one here is called Autumn Floral. So, 
And I get all of my craft products as far as paper products and everything from a cherry on top. Dot com and that's because every purchase I make I collect points and I can redeem those points in fact I redeemed 30,000 points I had collaborated and got collected and I got $15 off of my order yes the next collection here um, oh before we do the next collection I just ordered two sheets of this. This is called Hey Pumpkin. Um, this is from Crate Paper called Scaredy Cat. I just love the cat paper out of that collection. So I just ordered two sheets of the cat paper. So, <laughs> yep. Now this collection here is the Cartabella. I have been a fan of Cartabella for many, many years. I've loved their paper. Um, I've worked with their paper for a very long time. I'm never disappointed um, with their collections. Now, this collection is called Happy Halloween by Steve Duncan by Cartabella Paper Company. And, again, you're going to get uh, 12, 12 by 12 double-sided textured papers with a stickers. Now, what I'm assuming here is instead of getting doubles like in the other collection, you're going to get 12 individual patterns here. And I think that's what's going to happen. So here is the sticker sheet. Again, playing with the old and the new. I remember this witch here. I remember this from when I was in school. I remember my teachers would have something similar to this hanging on their door when I was in grade school. Um, a lot of this reminds me of my childhood. So I kind of wonder how old Steve Duncan is. Maybe he's the same age as me. <laughs> or around that around that time um so uh really really like this double double toll in trouble super cute just love it okay so if you are a uh, a scrapbooker that likes to do 12 by 12 scrapbook layouts this right here would be a cute one to do with uh put a picture you know and do, and rocking on and then on the back here we have this beautiful city scene here halloween town almost museum of mummies halloween i love it and then you have the old spooky house up on the hill in the back yes then we have a uh, happy haunting that's what this paper is called. It's Happy Haunting. Love it. Just love this. Journaling. Okay, this has three by four journaling cards on one side. And this one is called... No, this one just says journaling cards. So, there you go. And some more ephemera you can use and cut out. Journaling. I love it. That reminds me of my one of my black cats. And black cats are not uh, bad luck. This one is called Graveyard. And this obviously is a poem. And um, it says here, The Night Wind by Eugene Field. Have you ever heard the wind go, you? Tis a pitiful sound to hear. It seems to chill you through and through with a strange and speechless, speechless fear. Tis the voice of the night that broods outside when folks should be asleep and many, and many, many's the time I've cried to the darkness brooding far and wide over the land and the deep. Whom do you want, O lonely night, that you wail the long hours through? And the night would say in his ghostly way, you, you, you. My mother told me long ago when I was a little tad that went when the night went wailing so somebody had been ha <clears throat> excuse me somebody had been bad and then when i was snug in my bed whether i had been sent yeah whether i had been sent with the blankets pulled up around my head i think of what my mother said and wonder what boy she meant and who's been bad today i'd ask of the wind 
that hoarsely blew, and the voice would say in its meaningful way, you, you, you. Cute. I like that. Uh, what attracted me to this collection was the turquoisey colors, too, being used in here. And the way they've done some vintage uh, the vintage look like it's been worn, but I absolutely love that. <clears throat> then here we have the pumpkins. And this one's called Laughing Pumpkins. As you can see, they're all laughing. Uh, here's some more journaling cards. These are the 4 by 6 journaling cards. Then you have this one, a pretty trick or treaters, what I figured it would be called. And then you got the, oh, look at the little cats and the pumpkins. This one's called Toil and Trouble. I love that. I love the turquoise. Then we have the bats, and this one's called Bats Galore. Well, of course. Then we have this one, and this one's called Ghostly Damask. Ghostly Damask. Oh, it looks like it has face, a face in the damask, which is really cool. Can you see that? See the face? Really cool. And then this one, I'm sure, is probably called Halloween. All Hallows Eve. Yep. Love it. And last but not least, yep, last one. Um, costume Party. How cute is that? So, this collection here has um, 12 pattern pieces, uh, 12 or 12 paper in it. Also, I got the Ephemera pack. And it has the word scary in there. It has a lot of matching little things that will go really cute with this collection. Tags um, and stuff. So, yeah. I love it. So, that is the co Halloween collections that I have gotten this year. only get a couple. I don't go all out. Um, these are the ones that really grab me. If there's another one that I absolutely have to have, I will grab it. But other than that, um, this is my pick. So it's one is by Carnabella, and the other one is by Echo Park, along with um, a couple of sheets from Crate Paper. But love, love, love. So again, thank you all for stopping in and watching this. Um, paper haul. Um, tell me your favorite uh, Halloween collections down in the comment section below this year. Um, and also stay tuned for sneak peeks of what could be happening in September. Uh, yes, I'm going to keep you on your toes because um, I'm super excited about this. A lot of hard work has went into this and everything and um, I'm just, I'm just, I feel so positive about this. There is nothing no one can say, do, manipulate, bring up. There's nothing in this world that can happen that will ever make, the, uh, will ever put something bad with this. So, um, you know, past couple of years, I have really really worked on myself I've worked on the people that I have around me now and um, I have gotten rid of a lot of nasty people in my life and um, when you take the trash out you get to see the beauty in things so that's exactly what I've been doing it's what I did and I do not regret one moment so Stay tuned, and uh, I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.